This is it, boys. Straight to the fucking point. A minute and 50 seconds of this shit? Bro, this game looks so insane. If you have not been keeping up with, like, the hype around this, bro, then this is one that I suggest you guys keep up with, man. Like, this, this changes everything, in my opinion. It's like a kind of, like, you feel like Iron Man in this fucking game, I feel. Creating. Altering. Destroying. Bro. The anthem is all that remains. Anthem's bad? What are you talking about? This shit looks crazy. There's a storm coming. These walls can't protect us forever. Dude, this is like some Matrix. What was the name of that city in the Matrix? Zion? Bro, look at this. You are Iron Man, my nigga. This is so cool. I'm sorry. I, I don't, I'm not trying to fake hype shit, but I mean, you cannot tell me that's not badass. Destroy us all. It looks boring? What do you mean? You straight Tony Stark and niggas. Hopefully before Thanos came in. Oh shit. I remember seeing that from earlier and thinking, oh that's cool. Oh, they're on their destiny type of shit right now. They're on their destiny shit right now. Damn! Yo, thank you, thank you, my. Give me a second, bro. Genji, I need healing. <laughs> Genji came through last minute, clutch, baby. Bro, this shit is crazy. You cannot tell me that isn't hype, nigga. Fuck! Hold on. Okay, nigga. fine then. You guys want to be so judgmental? Oh, it's like Warframe. Oh, it's like Destiny. Did you ever even watch the gameplay today? I'm gonna watch the gameplay. Live demo. Live demo? Okay. Let's see. Damn, bro. Hey, this is like. Time to get to work. Faye said these bastards made some kind of asset and using it as a weapon. So, find is the eye tracker working? Shut it all down. It's the Titanfall feeling. Wow! Who are the guys that developed Titanfall again? That is amazing. Like, they take the mech inclusion so seriously. They show the whole animation to getting into the suit and all that. And I like the music of this too, like, it sounds so heroic. It's like, epic in Owen? a way. What's the plan here? Yeah. And you're online, my nigga? Can you imagine this? Squatting up with the team, rolling through a random world unexplored in a mech, knowing that you can, maybe there's functionality that you can jump out of the mech on some Diva Overwatch shit. <laughs> I don't know, but it looks interesting so far, and you all in voice chat and all that. <laughs> Just with the voice chat inclusion, we know this ain't coming to the, the Switch. The <laughs> no question. Be careful. Battle Royale... No, 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 no. Now you gotta stop, bro. I saw somebody, somebody said fucking Battle Royale. I got, I was trying to fucking find that nigga to time him out, but you know what? You got away from me this time, all right? You got away this time. Don't, so don't even start. Scars. The scars are hostile invaders. They have a mysterious connection to the shapers. And number Our players will learn <laughs> okay. more about them as they play through Anthem. So they show the numbers There's, going. That's kind of cool. In constant conflict with the freelancers. Now that we've dealt with right. that Sentry Checking Tower, scar, we can see. dive off this cliff and continue searching for the poison. Look at all the weapons. Oh, and the, and the turrets. But let me quickly. Bro, this is a... This is so beautiful. There is this like the top quality? encounter as you're exploring the world of Anthem. This is an Ash Titan. We could stay here and fight an this guy. An Ash he's Titan? Really too powerful for our group. So we're going to fly past him. Y'all were fucking him up, though. This is stronghold. Is... Dude, did you see that? Anthem is all about... Hold on, go yeah, back, my nigga. A fucking Ash Born Titan, Born. something that you just found randomly in the world. And this is like a boss, like, because here's the thing, right? You guys know how Xenoblade plays where it's like you can have like big ass enemies, but it's not really an action based game. So there's no real hit boxes in a sense. It's just you engage the enemy and the attacks auto hit in a sense, right? But this is different because it's like 
it, it's more of like action, like Zelda, Breath of the Wild, for instance. You run up on a big enemy. If you can dodge the enemy's hits and you consistently hit them, you can beat them eventually. Is this action based like that? Or would he just be able to like auto attack and kill you instantaneously? You know what I mean? This is an Ash Titan. We could stay here and fight this guy, but like, yeah, it's, I think it's action based. Everything's directly so fly hitting. Past him and proceed into that changes the game up. That means if you were nice enough dodging him, maybe you could take Anthony the nigga down with the friends. Teamwork. Ninpal, thank you, man. He says, sorry for the miscommunication earlier. What I meant to so ask was how many- This is a great opportunity to use all of our Javelin's abilities to complement one another and to get through a tough enemy encounter. So we can see here- Give me a second, I'll tell you. been mined by the scars. And we could maneuver around it, but the Colossus is just gonna pull out its shield and run through it, clearing the mines Yo. from the rest of the squad. So that's like a different type of um, Javelin. That's what they're calling There's these suits, right? Javelins. Wait, something's odd. Get a closer look, would you? You see those radiant pieces of energy? They're echoes from the Anthem of Creation. What? Loads of scars nearby. Be careful. Dude, I mean... Hold on, I gotta pause it just for a second. I'm gonna pause it to give my thoughts in the middle. I absolutely am in love with the dynamic of just riding through the sky with your friends Loads of at scars your side. Nearby. Like, Be careful. that is such a cool implementation right there. It's like you're playing Xenoblade Chronicles X, but multiplayer with your niggas. You know what I mean? Bro, straight up. So straight up is going to Elon Musk and niggas. There and freeze everyone in place. The Colossus will then use her multi-mortar and railgun to blow the Yo! They have it set up to where it's like um you have like a damage dealer, DPS, you have your tank, you have your healers over here. It's but it's all action based and it's like all mech like mechanics here. And what is this dude? He looks like a mage. He's teleporting on niggas? No, this is not. I mean, this looks kind of like Destiny and Warframe, but this looks, it's like unique in its own way, bro. I feel this is so cool. Hunter, thank you very, very much, man. I appreciate the donation. It's got silence. Disaster of Thank you. Do you think we can Give me a second. For... Wait, something's happening. What the hell was that? I think that was whatever laid all the eggs around here. The sound came from below your position. What the hell? You're like strategy the with this side, shit too, this man. This definitely counts toward hazard pay. There's a train of this acid gunk leading down. Follow it. We should find the source. So is this game going to be like focused on multiplayer? I mean, I can see them throwing in a little bit of like a campaign with this, but if the multiplayer vibe is like their number one priority, then maybe the plot won't be as heavy, but the gameplay purely is interesting enough for me. Like, do you remember Titanfall? Like, I, I make such references to old games, but Titanfall 1 specifically was kind of in the same boat where it didn't really have much of that whole, you know, single player oh, action going. It was all multiplayer, but... As long as the multiplayer is solid, then I think they have something good On the here. Plus side, this definitely counts toward hazard pay. There's a train of this I ain't playing this game. Uh, leading down. I... Follow it. We should find the source. The robot shit looks cool to me, man. The game is going to be full of microtransactions, glitches, and bugs. <laughs> well, can't argue with that. It is EA at the end of the day, right? The visuals of the game, though. Like, look at this environment, man. They're in a cave with stalactites and stalagmites and all this. And that, that, okay, all these monsters are looking like Zelda bosses, my nigga. Like, bro. That thing look like somebody's vagina mutated. I don't know what it is. It's not the kind of game that I guess you think I would be on board with. Like, maybe it doesn't fit, like, my exact criteria or my kind of, like, you know, setup. But, I mean, it looks so cool to me, man. The robot functionality changes the game in my book. Even though that's not a new thing at all. Bang10, thank you, man. He says, Etika, check out this trailer from E3 that went completely under the radar. It's lit as fuck, my boy. Bang10, you said the right words to me, my nigga. Let me check this thing out. A game that went under the... Quit being a bitch nigga and quit stalling. You gotta chug that fucking apple juice and get this shit. God started. damn, this is a while ago. This is a while ago. This is like two years ago, nigga. Fuck. Fuck out of here. What was wrong with me, bro? Anything that happens after this point, it was plus that made it go down. God damn, I really did it. I really drank all that moonshine. 
What the hell was wrong with you, nigga? Oh, I can't do it at one time. I can't even remember this. I mean, oh. <laughs> I don't even think it's because I was drunk. I just fucking repressed all these thoughts. <laughs> Fuck, this is so long ago. Man, this is 2016, of course, man. Good times back then, man. Then again, not really. <laughs> then again, not really. I was going through a lot of fucked up shit too at the time, but this is an oldie right here, man. Trust me, boys. There will be a lot of memories to make in the future, especially with this Smash Brothers shit going down.